Hello, Amy. You all right? So, baby, cat got your tongue? Oh, Steve, just leave her be, will you? What's the matter, darling? Uh, get out of her face! From now on, you talk to me, not her. Mum said Ryan's a druggie, and that's very bad and dangerous. Tracy! You have got to be kidding me. I can't stop you mixing with all sorts of trash, but I won't have my daughter dragged into it as well. You sick, twisted... You want to kick off in front of my daughter? I don't want her upsetting. For your information, my son's trying very hard to deal with his problem. Typical of you, though, innit? To be so judgmental. Oh, I'm sorry, babe. Can you just give us a minute? Please. Right, Tracy, you can stop this stirring. It's not going to get you anywhere. Steve, you are out of your mind. You're so besotted with that woman. It's pathetic. You're jealous, that's all. One day you'll realise what a huge mistake you're making. And that day you'll thank me for protecting our daughter. <sighs> your doctor get an award. From death's door to gorgeous in... How long's it been? <laughs> Shall I get that? No, I'm fine. I can manage. You only live there, why don't you go home first? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm a stud in your drugs corner. Would you rather have bought my paracetamol off you and not Dev? I'm not a dealer. Yeah, right. I'm not. I was only trying to help a neighbour. Oh, come on. I bet you and your mum have been writing my obituary for fun. Oi! Get here now. I'm talking to Tracy. Exactly. I'm in a bit of a catch face, Trace. Well, I think you've spent enough time in bad company recently. Good to see you on your feet. Nice chatting. We should do it again. Let me have that recipe, yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah. What are you doing talking to her? I don't see what the problem is. She's a good laugh. We should get her over for tea one day. Huh. We said, you'll have to let me have that recipe. Like they were busy mates. What recipe? Nothing. They're just trying to wind me up. No, oh, well, don't let them. I'm not. I see through her little games. Recipe. Tracy's the flaming recipe. Recipe for disaster. How soon after someone's been discharged from hospital is it okay to give them a slap? Tracy, hospital car park. Huh? <laughs> Damn. What's with the face? Oh no, it's just Ryan. Tried everything. Wine, pork scratching. <laughs> Do you really think you can pull shell out of a cob on with pork scratchings? You really don't know her, do you? Well, we have been out before, you know, so... Well, it takes time. But there's only really one thing that will pull her out of that kind of mood. I can't believe I'm gonna do this. OK, you can tell him the story about girls versus boys penalty shootout at school sports day, <laughs> but make it quick. I don't come out of this very well. She does. Patience, love. 